For the second time in 2022, stargazers will have the opportunity to view a total lunar eclipse on November 8. At least a portion of the phenomenon will be visible throughout Eastern Asia, Australia, the Pacific, and North America. The previous total lunar eclipse happened in May. A total lunar eclipse occurs when Earth casts a complete shadow A called an umbra A over the Moon. According to Alphonse Sterling, astrophysicist from NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center in Huntsville, Alabama, total lunar eclipses occur approximately once every 1.5 years on average, while the Moon has been providing generous eclipse viewing opportunities this year. Viewers should take advantage of November's eclipse because the next total lunar eclipse will not occur until 2025. For North America the action will start in the early hours of the morning on November 8. The partial eclipse will begin at 3.09 a.m. CST, with totality beginning at 4.16 a.m. and ending at 5.42 a.m. Then, the partial phase will resume, lasting until 6.49 a.m. Those in the eastern part of the United States will miss most or all of the last partial phase because the moon will set during totality or shortly after totality ends. No special eye protection is needed for viewing a lunar eclipse. Unlike solar eclipses, which occur during the daytime, while the lunar eclipse can be observed with the unaided eye, a pair of binoculars or a telescope can enhance the view. Sterling says a fun activity for those who stargaze with family or friends is to discuss who notices the reddish hue of totality first and how it progresses throughout the eclipse. Thanks for watching.